It is all about WestJet, Canada's second largest airline. Today, we would like to show you what would be the best possible combo credit cards in Canada to collect these WestJet dollars. Let's actually welcome you to the Canada Credit Card Expert channel. If you did decide to subscribe right at the bottom, we would definitely appreciate it as it does help the channel. We would like to actually provide you with all relevant information about credit cards in Canada and the best most suitable credit cards for your personal usage. Today, we would like to help you actually look at two sets of credit cards, which combined would actually give you the best possible earning on the WestJet airline frequent flyer program, WestJet Dollars. WestJet is the second largest in Canada, as mentioned. It is heavily actually geared towards Western Canada, but it does have operations in the East as well. It did recently actually get heavily into the uh, vacation uh, sector as well. So at the end of the day, it does have huge openings for Canadians when it comes to actually opportunities to actually fly in and out of the country. And recently it actually expanded into Asia as well. So some of you might be actually looking into it while at the same time, recent agreements with a few airlines, especially SkyTeam Alliance type of airlines, Air France, KLM, uh, Delta Airlines and Korean Airlines. The, these airlines are actually involved with WestJet when it comes to earn and burn. So let's actually look into the WestJet dollars. That might be an attractive option for you, especially in Western Canada, but not only. So let's actually start with the co-branded credit cards. We do actually see both of them on the screen right now. Well, firstly, the basic Category 2 MasterCard by RBC. And that is $39 for the annual fee, $19 for the supplementary card if you wish to have one. And that particular credit card would actually come with one WestJet dollar per dollar spent and one and a half per dollar spent on WestJet flight. So it's pretty simple, one and one and a half, one on everything else and one and a half on the core brand credit card. Uh, airline. Now, this particular airline would have one major perk, which is the companion voucher. And the companion voucher, in the case of the basic, this basic category two credit card, would actually mean that within Canada and the United States, but doesn't include the state of Hawaii in the United States, you would be able to get a companion voucher uh, for that means a second person traveling. Uh, for $199 in economy return ticket anywhere in the United States and Canada, again, excluding Hawaii, plus taxes, or if you elected to actually book a premium ticket for yourself, for example, then this second person, you would be able to actually uh, book this uh, second ticket for $299 plus taxes. So it's $199 or $299, dep depending on the class. Now, when it comes to insurances, Pretty basic, but not that bad for a Category 2, 39 bucks a year credit card. It does actually come with the basic purchase and extended warranty insurances, but it does actually come with hotel motel burglary, which is pretty unique to, to RBC across the board. But we could actually also say that you do actually get the car rental uh, loss and damage waiver insurance, which is nice to have for a card which is $39, and it's a core brand card. So it's pretty much what you have within this card, pretty straightforward, and that obviously, that is your entry level into the program. Now, if you would like to elevate this thing called earning and perks with WestJet, you would necessitate $80,000 annual income in order to qualify for the Category 4. Again, RBC-issued World Elite MasterCard WestJet core brand card. So let's again look at the table and actually compare the earn ratio. And that means two WestJet dollars to one dollar spent on WestJet flights and one and a half WestJet dollars for one dollar spent on anything else. Now, there is a, a, something interesting here that you, you could actually be looking at because that is a MasterCard. And as, as it is now October 2024, and we know that at this at, at this time, Costco Canada only accepts MasterCard, we would actually argue that that is by far the best core brand credit card in Canada to use in Costco. In fact, getting 1.5% back in WestJet dollars 
is probably better than anything else you could be getting out of by using a MasterCard. And we are talking about straight usage of credit cards, that is, of MasterCards in uh, Costco. Costco would normally normally qualify as a as a general general merchandise, anything else type of thing, because it really does, if at all, qualifies as groceries, etc. So it is normally you get one point, but in this case you get one and a half. Of course, there is a Costco core brand credit card with CIBC, and we will actually uh, put a link down there to, because we do have a video actually covering that. But just on, on a curiosity point of, of interest, the WestJet Wall Delete MasterCard could actually double as your Costco card with, with a great earn ratio of one and a half WestJet dollar per dollar spent pretty much across the board, but also in Costco Canada. Now, a few more things about this particular card before we move to this next uh, set of credit cards to actually combine the two. Well, this credit card does also have Obviously, the companion voucher as the previous credit card mentioned that you see on the screen. But this companion voucher would actually have two different things about it. Firstly, the return ticket could actually be booked for a companion beyond North America. So pretty much you do have North America and then you have anything beyond North America. And that pretty much could mean Caribbean, Europe and Asia. Recently, WestJet started flying to both, uh, both Seoul in Korea and Tokyo in Japan. So pretty much that could be huge and there are huge savings actually with this particular companion voucher. Also, this particular companion voucher could be converted into four lounge passes and these lounge passes could be used on any of the WestJet designated lounges. So if you don't have anyone to take with you or you don't feel like actually using the companion voucher you don't want to travel this year or whatever the case is you could actually convert it into four entries into four designated WestJet lounges within their system just to remind you WestJet does have only one branded uh, lounge uh, basically one across the system in Calgary uh, lounge but at the same time you could actually be using it in other lounges that are designated for uh, WestJet. So in the case of this particular credit card, Canada and the US economy would be $119 plus taxes for economy and $219 for premium. Again, Canada, US, and that is $80 less than what you would get for the companion voucher with the other card. Now, if you were to use the companion voucher globally, that would actually mean $399 plus tax, or what we think is a humongous value, $499 plus tax for premium booking on WestJet flights, return flights, that is, beyond North America. Now, that, that is massive because if you were to fly to Europe or to, say, Japan or Korea, $499 plus tax for the second person is absolutely great. So that is a great value of this particular credit card by going just to mention this particular credit card would also go as well would also allow you to convert these vouchers now one more thing about this particular credit card which uh, I believe uh, yet to be mentioned it's $119 it's not actually a massive price for a category 4 credit card and basically that will work out to be $59 if you wanted a supplementary card but other than that, it does actually get you, on top of it, a free checked uh, luggage. Basically, one piece of checked luggage is actually included with this credit card on WestJet Fly. So that is kind of similar to what uh, most of the Air Canada, uh, the non-entry credit cards core brand would actually have. So to wrap it up with this particular credit card, we will just briefly mention something actually a little bit uh, interesting if you are into status. Every 15k spent on this card uh, in a calendar year would actually get you $500 in qualifying uh, dollars towards your next status, up to a total of $1,500. So status lift is actually nice to have if you chase status. And other than that, uh, definitely the insurances here are definitely better. So just to man mention briefly, the insurances we got on the basic card plus 
15 days of emergency travel insurance, uh, delayed baggage, flight delay, uh, etc. So that, that particular credit card would have slightly enhanced, uh, well, much enhanced insurances as well. Now, just to mention before we move to the second combo, the second set of credit cards that is for the combo, as of October 2024, FlexiRoam is actually easing with MasterCard as a World Elite uh, perk. So you will actually get with the card three times free one gigabyte to roam and easing while you're actually traveling. Nice to have, nice to know. Now briefly, let's actually move into the next set of credit cards that would definitely propel your earnings with WestJet dollars. And we are talking about the RBC issued ION credit cards. ION and ION Plus. The ION would actually be no annual fee and would earn you on everything one Avion premium point, which is transferable to WestJet dollars at a rate of 100 Avion to one WestJet dollar. And the same would actually work with the ION Plus. However, the ION Plus would earn the same on everything else, while it would actually cost you $4 per month. But in return, you will be earning much more on the accelerators. Let's have a look at them. There are three types of accelerators. Everything food, which means groceries and restaurants. Everything transportation, which means transit, rideshare, and gas, which you might be reminded that RBC does have an arrangement with Petro Canada where you could actually enhance your points to the tune of 20% when you fill up at the pump. So that would definitely give you even 20% boost in Petro Canada in this particular category. Plus, you have another accelerator which is actually streaming. So these accelerators would earn you respectively 1.5 Avion per $1 spent with the iron. And with the iron plus, that would go up to three. And again, the transfer of these points, Avion points, from these iron cards to WestJet dollars is actually making your earning with WestJet much, much more attractive. So if you take these two sets of two sets of credit cards and you can actually select yourself one of each, you get the best possible combo. Let's look at it. If you do have the World Elite MasterCard WestJet, you don't actually need the iron because anyway, you will be earning 1.5 minimum on anything. However, if you do have the World Elite MasterCard WestJet and you definitely want your earning, we are talking about a combo that will cost you a total of $167 a year. That means $119 plus $48 and would get you three WestJet dollars through the Ion Plus accelerators plus a minimum of 1.5 for everything else with the World Elite MasterCard. And that also, as mentioned, Costco. Now, if you decided or you cannot get the World Elite MasterCard you don't want or you don't want to spend that much money, then definitely for $39 you could get both basic cards. You get the Iron for no annual fee and you get the WestJet MasterCard for $39. So basically the combos, the possible combos are either the entry-level cards category 2 WestJet MasterCard no annual fee or you're getting the category 3 Ion Plus $48 Plus, you are getting the World Elite MasterCard Category 4 with all these little perks, companion voucher, insurances, etc. So these two possibilities are there for you to enhance your WestJet dollars. One end, $167 a year, or the other end, you have $39 a year. Again, we actually think that if you could get the World Elite MasterCard and Iron Plus, that is kind of obvious. $3 per one on all these accelerators is absolutely amazing. So feel free to actually leave your comments right at the bottom. If you do actually come up with any different strategy, we would definitely be happy to hear about it. And we hope, we truly hope, that we help you today accelerating your WestJet dollars earning. We will see you soon.